Please stand by for an important announcement. Good evening, all. At the time of recording, this is 6.59, December 30th, 2023, the second to last day. The t- by the time it's being uploaded or aired, it will be 6 o'clock and the last day of 2023. Time and temperature is brought to you by Raymond Flanagan. Surround yourself. Let me just shut this off. Uh, anyways. It's been quite... It's been quite a long, a long road to get here, sorry. Um, yeah. 2023 has definitely had its struggles. I've definitely had my share, fair share of struggles in 2023. I was going through a pretty rough time at home. I think like l- later in the year, I was just having a rough time at home. Then my mom got sick. My adoptive mom got sick, she had to go in the hospital, so I went to stay with my uh, biological mom for a while, by the way, both are amazing, amazing, amazing people, just want to put out, put that out there right now, shut up phone, uh, anyways, um, and yeah, things, were, shut up, uh, anyways, um, sorry, my phone here. Anyways, um, uh, things were going all right for like about a month or so, almost a month, until one day while we were driving, someone decided to. Anyways, uh, one night while we were driving on October the twenty fifth, I don't know what happened, but someone was probably driving like a complete moron because. Everyone knows drivers in New Jersey cannot drive at all. All right? They, they just cannot drive. They can't drive. And that's just the truth. Anyways. um, uh, Anyways, yeah. So, yeah, that happened. And I was in, a, in the hospital for well over a month. I think I got out um uh last week on the twenty first. On the twenty first, that's when I finally got out of the hospital. So yeah. I'm staying at some uh temporary uh, studios, um, as you might call it in Elizabeth. I'm just trying to get everything situated so we can start production of uh some some of our programs again. And, uh, yeah, uh, once everything is, uh, set up, then hopefully, um, um, I might, uh, do a little, uh, tour of the place. You know, that actually sounds like a good idea. Um, I'll show you a tour of my, uh, room. All right, so uh, this is what it looks like so far. Um, there's my stuff. There's a Squirtle plushie that I got. There's my TV and a PS3. And if you don't know what that is over there, uh, this is like a 10-pack of VHS tapes that I got. Um, that uh, my teacher's bought for me. And hopefully I'll be getting uh, my BHS player back from my house. 
And I'm also doing like a backup VHS player as well. So, yeah. I also got some uh, USB, USB HDMI cords. Uh, so, I also got this the Ego speaker, the Fendi Cube. These are all just uh, Christmas presents that uh, my uh, teachers got me. Except this. I got this the day of the accident. Believe it or not. Here's some VR glasses. That's me. What's up? How you doing? I've survived 2023. Let's go. Uh, got this. I don't know what that's doing here. Uh, got... Chromebook, stupidest computer ever to be put to paper, um, and some old spice. And yeah, that's pretty much it for now. Nothing too interesting. I got a nice view out the window. So, uh, yeah, that's a tour of my room, I guess. All right, um... Now, before um, I uh, cut this video off and uh, officially pen 2023 for the history books, um, I just like to uh, just like to extend a very, very warm and sincere thank you to all of you, each and every single one of you. That's gotten me through this year. 2023, 2023 was just, just a free struggle. And probably, personally, my worst year. I hated it. I hated it. But despite all this year threw at me, you guys were there for me. You guys were there for me every single step of the way. Every single step of the way. And I just want to thank each and every single one of you for that. I mean it. You guys mean the friggin' world to me. So, yeah. I just wanted to come on here, explain what's been going on recently. And just... Just to say thank you. Thank you for sticking around with me, even though the world's been pretty unkind to me this past, this, this past year. But we may see it through it. We're going to make promise together. We're going to make 2024 a lot better than 2023, and that's a promise that I intend to keep. 2024 is going to be a lot, a lot better than 2023. That's a promise that I intend to keep. Uh, yeah. And I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad I finally... I'm, I'm glad uh, this year's finally over with. I'm glad I finally, finally made it out. I finally made it. We finally, we made it out. We made it out together. Just wanted to end up by saying again, thank you all, each and every single one of you, for being there for me. This is Malik Stevens Bush on behalf of the staff and the entire staff and management of and everyone that's behind all my shows for NBC, behind the shows for Channel 55, and just everyone, my friends, pretty much everyone, I just want to wish, and my viewers, of course, my viewers, I wouldn't be anywhere today without my my loyal viewers. I just want to say to all of you, have a safe and happy new year. 
This is Malik Stevens Bush, the founder and CEO of KJJ TV Five. Uh, wishing you a very happy new year. And as always in parting, wishing you love, peace, and soul.